Hello everybody, Drifty here from Driftwood Gaming, and we're going to continue our JavaScript tutorial series for RPG Maker MV Engine. So, in this episode, we're going to talk about how to add and remove gold with the JavaScript command. We're going to talk about how to add and remove items, armors, and weapons with the JavaScript command. So here we go, we're going to look at this uh, first uh, command here. It's we're going to do dollar sign game capital P on party dot gain capital G on gold. And that's a function. And inside this, what inside this, these set of parentheses, whatever number you put will be um, how much it adds or removes. Now, you may be thinking, well, what if I want to take away gold? How am I going to do that? Well, it, you wouldn't type like lose gold or remove gold. You would still use gain gold. But the thing is, you would use a negative number. So if I did negative a thousand, it's going to actually take away a thousand gold. If I did a thousand inside of the dot gain gold, then it would add a thousand. So that's how you would handle that. Uh, for items, what you would do is dollar sign game party dot gain item capital I on item, and then inside the parentheses you do a dollar sign data capital I on items. And now pay attention here. This is not a parentheses. This is actually a bracket. So we're going to do a bracket to specify that we're talking about an array. So we're going to type the item ID in the array. And you wouldn't type item ID. You would type a number like, say, 1 for a magnifying glass or 2 for a repel or whatever you wanted to do. The N here is going to stand for how many of that item. So if I did, like, uh, 1, 5, I know magnifying glass is the first item in my database. So this would add 5 magnifying glasses to uh, the party. So the same thing would happen for weapons and armor, but there's one more argument inside of the uh, set of parentheses. Uh, the thing that you're going to do inside here, it's the same thing, dot gain item, but what we're going to do is reference the data weapons uh, array. So we're going to do dollar sign data capital W on weapons, and inside here you would also put a number that you'd want, let's say like 20, it's going to add weapon whatever's in the number 20 slot. Same thing here. <clears throat> this is going to tell you how many. Now, you could also do a negative number here. And the next uh, argument in this function is going to determine when we're removing an item, are we going to, how is it going to know if, if, it's a, if we're going to talk, if we wanted to talk about being equipped or not. So if they're using the weapon that we're removing and we want to remove it while they have it equipped, we would put true here. So if we don't want to take away, uh, we want to take away an item, but we don't want to remove the item if it's currently equipped, then we would replace that with false. So that's what this stands for. True if you want to take away an item that's equipped. False if you don't want to take away an item that's equipped. So for armors, it's the same thing, except you're going to do uh, capital A on armors instead of weapons. And uh, we're talking about the data armors array, and we would just put it in a number right here. And that would add uh, one of the um, armor number 11 and that's basically it so let's go ahead and do that we're gonna set this to a positive number since it will actually do nothing since we don't have any items at the beginning yeah we'll just say true it doesn't really matter at this point because um, we're not taking away items so I'm actually want to I want to test this to see We'll just put a show text with something there just to know that something has happened. Let's go ahead and create our starting point here. Save the game. Alright, so we should have a thousand gold. We got it. We should have five magnifying glasses. We've got a iron katana and a harp. So this was already equipped. It's added the harp. That was the item it added. And then the armor it added was the leather gloves. We already had those two from starting. So we've added one leather gloves, one harp, five magnifying glasses, and a thousand gold. And that's pretty it. Really, uh, That's pretty much it. Really, really simple. Um, so that's how you would add and remove gold. That's how you would add items, weapons, and armors with the JavaScript command. 
So thank you guys so much for watching. If you found this video informative or helpful, please like, favorite, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. I really appreciate you guys. I got a new mic today. Hopefully you guys could notice any uh, a change in the audio quality. I got a Blue Yeti Pro. So yeah, uh, even, even better audio quality on the channel. So thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys in the next tutorial.